Hey, yo, what's good, y'all? It's your boy, y'all stunning, you know what I'm saying? I just got twisted up. Matter of fact, I got twisted like two days ago. I meant to make a video like a before when I got twisted, when I had it flow and everything. Then the after the video, I got twisted, but you know, with school and everything, like, I didn't even get a chance around to it, you know. But yeah, I'm growing my hair for six months. I started, like, I was supposed to start getting dressed like last, I would say last July or last, yeah, last July or last August. Now, yeah, last July. I was supposed to get it then, but then, like, I used to have an afro or whatever. But I used to go to the barber and get shaped so my afro would be even. Then when I came, come to find out, when my hair grew up, my left side was small as hell. And my, my, this side was all even, this side was small as hell, so I had to get that shit cut. July 26th is when I got my hair cut. My first haircut to start dreads, I got it all even. No tapers, no nothing, no ball fades, no nothing like that. No special designs, just all even. So I got that. Been growing my hair out since six months. And now this is where we at. Like, my hair was, uh, how long was my hair? My hair was an inch, an inch and a half before I got dreaded. But I said, I'm gonna show y'all, make it before and after video, but I never got around to that shit, though, bro. But yeah, I'm just gonna show y'all how my shit look. Like, you know, like, y'all see that? Yeah, it's like an inch and a half right now. But yeah, I'm, I'm actually excited. For this dread journey, you know, but yeah, you know when I first got twisted, I've been thinking about cutting it and shit. You know, everybody get that face. So when they just feel like cutting their dreads, like, no, I just don't look right, I look fucked up. Like they be thinking about that shit, but me, I was thinking about it. But now I said, fuck it, I'm just gonna do it for the long run. But right now I'm at the ugly ass nigga phase. I look like ODB or Mac Daddy from Crisscross and shit. But you know, I got over that shit. I was insecure and shit, I was wearing my hat everywhere. When I first got them, but now I just rock my shit. I don't even care. And I didn't want dreads because the whole Chief Keef movement. Like, I know there's a big ass movement going around about niggas getting dreads from that Chief Keef shit. Like, no, nah, I didn't want it. I've been wanting dreads since like 2004. Yeah. 2004, 2006. Back when the Crime Mob, whatever was in. So, yeah, 2005 actually. Because I know I saw a nigga in the, um, the Franchise Boys. And I used to be obsessed with dreads. I always used to want that shit. And I don't know who else. And uh, oh, this nigga's name C. Bodie. I used to listen to that nigga came up with a song called Dread Boy back in 2007, 2008. And I was just one of Dread since then, especially when that nigga, I was Soulja Boy first popped off back in 2007. When that nigga A Rab, I want to Dread since then. Like, I just wanted something to sway. I want to Dread for a while though. Shit. But um, yeah, I'm excited for my Dread journey though. And plus, the reason why I got Dreads now, because like, your early. Your early 20s and your teens is the best time in your life to rock dreads for real. Because what I look like being a like 27, 30 year old nigga rocking dreads and shit. I got the rest of my life to get my hair cut. I used to rock waves, get my hair cut 24-7. I had the rest of my life to get my hair cut. So I'm just going to grow my dreads out for like two years or whatever. Two, three years and get them cut. And see how long I can get them. Like, yeah. Are we focusing? I hope I'm not. Nah, I think I'm cool. But uh, yeah. But yeah, I'm about to, I'm about to show y'all the products I'm using. All right. The first product I'm using is this shit called Magical Bro. Well, I know they got two kinds of this shit, so I'm gonna show y'all the kind I'm using. I got this from that one nigga, um, TMAs on YouTube. I know everybody saw his dread journey. But um, yeah, you can get this for like six dollars at the uh, beauty store. <laughs> I ain't bad. I just got the one. I ain't bad. 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 I just got the exact kind he used. The nigga said it was cracking the drummer, so I said, fuck it, I'll just try it out. The second shit I got was, um, the second shit I got was this shit. Cause my lactician told me I should get it, so I just said, fuck it, I'll get it. This is $5 too. I don't know how much it is, like where y'all at, but I stay in Cleveland, Ohio. So, Cleveland, Ohio is $5. Man. It's a lot of good shit. Smells like 
smells it smells like Vicks. Vicks and peppermint. It's green and shit. Got that in the third product right here. This cactus oil serum shit. By Mango Line. This is also $5 too. Hey, yep. Like, let me focus in. My bad. I got one of these hot ticket ass cameras, so you gotta focus in. So, yeah, basically, that's it. Like, I can't wait to see where my dread journey go. I'm gonna... I can't wait to see how long it get too. I'm gonna be shaking my shit. But the only thing I was kind of like bothered by is like, I can't even really wash my hair for three months. Like me, I'm a clean ass nigga. <laughs> yeah, I'm a clean ass nigga. So, you know, I gotta stay clean. I can like wash my hair and shit, but you can't let moisture touch your hair for three months. Like, damn, that's a long ass time. But I think by that time I'll, yeah, right now today is january 30th so i don't know when i'm gonna post this video but today is january 30th and uh and i gotta have my shit locked for six months before i can wash it so january damn and fucking july actually but i gotta wait that long to wash my shit but yeah you know i was contemplating because i used to have like a small fro and i know my dreads ain't that long but i was contemplating on should i get locked up or not because i don't want that Shitty nigga look or whatever that little nigga look, but you know I just decided just to get locked up so I can, my shit can lock easier and lock faster. So when my hair gets longer, I know it's harder to lock longer dreads. So I said, "Fuck it, I was getting locked now." So whatever. So yeah, basically that's it. That's it. But comment below, give me some tips, cause I'm you know I'm new with this whole dread shit. Give me some tips and shit on what I should do, what products I should get. I also treat my hair like how to treat dreads, how to keep them fresh. Like, I, I'll take any advice. I read the comments below because, you know, I'll be bored as fuck sometimes, so I'll just read them. And I, I'm not a stubborn headed ass, hard headed nigga, and I'll take advice from people, so. Yup. Yeah. My shit, my shit look nice, though. I mean, you get confidence on my shit. That's how good my shit look. But, um, yeah, I'm gonna give y'all like a 360 view, too, so y'all can see how. No, my hair is this the front, the side, the back. I don't even know how the back look yet because I haven't even checked it. But uh, that's that. Let's let's uh, let's uh, I'm getting a close up view so y'all can see better. The side, back. It's whatever. Oh yeah, basically. I'm, oh yeah, I've got to tell y'all. Like when I wash my hair and shit, they told me you gotta use some shower cap and shit. You're like a fucking jellyfish. And if I can get this cap, hold up. Shut up. And I use this in my sleep. Fuck. Should lean it down, trying to fall in there. I'll be using the satin cap when I sleep and just throw it on. Be in there sleep like I look like a this guy's making like a dawn though. But yeah. Basically that's it. I can't wait. But like I said, comment below. Tell me what I should do. Tell me y'all what suggest. Give me some hips on some what to do's and not to do's and shit. Yeah, I'm out. Make sure y'all comment, subscribe, do all that good shit. Alright.